Howdy folks, Skrock the Duck Farmer here, and I'm on the FTOG Ozone Skyblock Reborn server, and it may be certain death. Uh, yes, because I'm going to do a thing. I'm going to do a thing with um, these, the chance cubes, and I'm just going to open them one at a time. I'm going to open up the big block. And by that, I mean that the three by three by three, there's 27 of them there. Yes. And I've got enough here for four more. So we'll see how this goes. Uh, what have I done? I have I've got all my normal stuff on here. I did take my repair gadget and took it off because I just barely got that. I do not want to lose that at all. That would be bad. <laughs> so. Oh, that's not ominous in any way. <laughs> Anything else I've got on here, I'm okay. I, I will feel sad losing all this stuff, but I can remake it. So it, it's not a terrible, terrible thing. Uh, let's see how it goes. All right, I am just backing up. <laughs> I don't see anything happening here oh nope whole bunch of bats <laughs> that's a whole lot of bats okay so we've got a massive spawn of bats well we have a command block on the server that will kill bats like every five minutes or so uh because otherwise we'd just have a monster spawn 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 of bats in anything dark and there doesn't seem to be any any mob cap or anything like that. They just spawn. So uh, they're they're gonna disappear disappear after a short little bit, unless I'm given some task to like you know kill them. Here, let's use the actual sword sword. Ah, come on, stop moving! <laughs> I'm trying to kill you. <laughs> These things dodge so fast. Nope, missed. All right, I think all that's going to do is produce... There we go. Why, I got one. Uh, I think that's just going to produce bats. That's all it is. And uh, the little mini-map shows so many of them. Uh, in a certain amount of time from now, they're just going to go and they're going to be gone. All right, well, that's kind of a dud. Let's go try the next and see what we can do here. All right. Yeah, I have no control. These are completely random. There's information as to what they do. I have no idea. None whatsoever as to what they're going to be. Uh, although I, some of these, these big ones I've seen actually have some massive spawning. So that's why I'm far, far away from my base, which is way over there, out of, out of sight. <laughs> All right, let's uh, see what this is going to do. Back up, back up. It's called Art Lookup. Look at all those potions. <laughs> That's a spew of potions everywhere. I have no idea. Okay, let's have a potion. Nope, it missed me. Let's see what this potion is. Nope, missed me again. I missed, oh well, <laughs> that was a lot of potions, not just a few, that was a lot of potions. And most of the bats seem to be gone. I wonder if they, or they're just too far below me. I don't know, uh, we'll, we'll see. All right, uh, round three, Charlie stops scraping there. I don't know if you can hear him. There's a closet that he wants to get into. Okay. Time to uh, slightly murder a cat. All right. He wasn't murdered. He was just gently persuaded to stop. <laughs> and for some reason, that closet, because we have it closed all the time, both cats are super interested in it. And uh, same with Nice the Duck Farmer's uh, room, because we keep that closed all the time as well. They love to go in there and just enjoy the room. <laughs> Doom. All right, uh, let's. It's weird the the block tracing on that. Anyway, um, round three. Oop. 
there's a whole bunch of glass appearing there. All right. Anything going into the glass? Oh yeah, there's a whole bunch of uh, different blocks and whatnot being placed in there. Lots of different fluids. Looks like a lot of those fluids are just overdoing other fluids and stuff. Huh. Okay. Uh, I, I may be able to mine some useful fluids out of that. Uh, another reason why you really wouldn't want to do this inside your base, because that would be bad. <laughs> so I'll leave that up uh, wrong direction. That's interesting. I've not seen that one before, and it's been a long time since I've broken any of these uh, chance cubes uh, because they tend to be quite chancy. OK, let's drift over to this side. And none of the, the fluids in there are recognized as something I, I really needed to access, but we'll find out much, much later. All right. So if I just go ahead and craft up the next one. Do, 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 do. And I, I want to make sure I don't misclick any of these. Ready? Doom. And back up. Whoa. <laughs> Multiple blocks. Oh, cool. Uh, there's three. Yeah, this would play havoc with uh, your base. <laughs> but there looks like a whole bunch of really cool ores in here. Uh, yeah, I may be able to get me some of the, the Venus stuff that I need. Ooh, uh, ooh, okay, let's look at the thingy I, again I needed. It was, if I want a red, no, 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 dark matter. That's what I need. If I get some dark matter, where's the dark matter? Uh, yes, I need the calorite ingot. Since I, I, I might actually have some calorite ingots in here, maybe it looks so much like uh, just there's Mars or I wonder um, I'm, I like that. I, I will mine that. And um, OK, that's a good one. <laughs> that's a definite good one. And I don't see any bats on the map anymore. I think they have either gone down to the 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 bedrock or they've been deleted by the the command block which we have let's go a little okay that's a good one that's a very good one i'm very curious as to what results i'll get from that well uh, yay <laughs> if i can get the all right then or whatever the, then i should be able to make some more dark matter and that might be able to unlock a little bit of uh, project e for me without actually going to venus ready all right backing up backing up oh i may get another sphere of um liquids it's interesting let's uh are you a liquid thing again no, that looks like a, a different type. Well, it's a different type of liquid. It's all the same liquid. I'm curious as... To, oh, there's something going on in there. Break that. Vegetable oil. Hmm. Okay. Well, uh, I've got a whole bunch of vegetable oil in there. <laughs> I... I, I, I don't know if I really need any vegetable oil right now, but maybe because I want to do some pneumaticraft stuff uh, that I'm there may be something really useful in there and just a bunch of random liquids of who knows what that that I'm liking. OK, I think I will go back to base and see if I've got enough for more. I've, I've got a, probably enough for a bunch more of these. These have all been good. And so far, we've not had certain death so i'm okay with that it so happens i have exactly enough to do nine more of these and oh nope 10 <laughs> i have exactly enough to make 10 more of these here i'll put it right there there we go exactly enough for 10 more of these uh, which is fantastic because uh so far it's been good uh the the random potions was kind of a 
eh. The bats was eh. But so far, nothing that that really has been a horrible experience yet. Uh, maybe the phantoms will have a horrible experience. Whatever, we'll find out. All right, let's break that. And I, I'm remembering there was one that made like a, a giant dome that had a, a, a desert biome sort of set up in it. <laughs> I do like that. And there we go. <laughs> this is again why you don't do this in your base. <laughs> uh, flying TT TNT is so much. Whoa! Ah. <clears throat> that was fun. <laughs> I'm so glad I didn't do that in the base. That would have been. Uh, yeah, there would have been so much destruction. All right, so that's good. Uh, so that one, I would definitely say that is a definite negative. Having that happen in your base mm, or, 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 you know, not being able to fly your way out of there really fast. Also a bad idea. So uh, am I happy I have flight? Oh, yes, I am. And I have lost track of the count, but I don't care. I'm having fun with these. Ready for the doom? Doom. <laughs> backing up, backing up. Oh, this, here's another one of those massive. Oh, hey. Uh, this is another one of those those massive world destroying sort of setups. That uh, yeah, this would be all sorts of problems. What's flying around a whole bunch? Huh. OK, bears are eating the 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 snowman we got a whole bunch of blizzes in here uh nothing i care about uh but uh hey this is a way of getting a lot of snow if if you're very interested in snow and i have a lot of glass here too <laughs> so uh yeah that that definitely works uh i wonder if nah you know i can make the 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 various powders so i don't care about those very much all right uh that's a that's a nice snow globe but um, well, all right, <laughs> let's go make some more. All right, let's grab that one. And I'm going to go this direction. I, I, I don't want to do anything that will destroy my ores because I'm really crossing my fingers that I have some ores in there to make a bunch of, of dark matter. That would that would unlock a bunch of things with uh, Project E. But Eventually, we'll get to Venus and we'll be able to mine it and then that'll totally unlock it. But someday <laughs> we'll see how it goes. I am so loving the, the repair as talisman. Ready for the doom? <laughs> it's so loud in my ears and I, I do tend to have the game sounds quieter uh, because of problems. If people are listening with headsets, here we go. Backing up. Oh, oh, OK. I was sitting there thinking for a second. Oh, crap. I'm going to ruin my ores, but nope. We're getting ourselves a whole lot of. Dirt over here. Uh, I'm thinking something's going to appear here. Oh, this may be a village coming in. And I think hopefully it will miss my snow globe. Yeah, I think this is going to be a village. Uh, it may hit my snow globe. It may, it may, it may. It's still going, it's still going. We still have stuff. Uh, we've hit snow globe. Uh, but we might actually miss it actually doing anything. All I've got is polar bears in there now. Okay. Uh, village Apirus. Okay, I'm definitely not magical. If, in case you were ever wondering, yeah, I'm not. Oh, so there's the, the next layer. Yeah, this is a village. Cool. Oh, and we've got pigs over here because of the, the dirt. All right, yeah. And uh, I'm assuming villagers will appear here in a, a bit. This is very nice. Uh, 
I wonder if the paths will appear or if, if they're considered something that will not. Huh. Uh, I think that's it. I think the paths are not coming through for some reason. And I see no evidence of villagers here. That's pretty cool. Okay, I'll, I'll search through that later. Uh, in case there's anything of any interest, but I'll definitely want to, to tear all these things down so they're not just kind of hanging out here. That's kind of ugly. All right, next. Very few really bad ones uh, up to this point, which is okay with me. Okay with me. I'm, and I'm, I'm amazed that we, we missed the snow globe by one block layer. <laughs> so cool. That is huge. That is a huge area. And obviously a, um, a path bug because uh, with those uh, trampled paths uh, not showing up right. Hmm. Okay, let's get a little bit further away from that so we don't uh, cause problems. All right, next. Whichever number it is, I don't care. All right, cover your ears, ready for the doom. Inferting blocks. I'm backing up a whole bunch. I wonder if it just takes whatever blocks were there and just swaps them around. So if you had like dirt, it turns into gold or stone or I don't know. Hmm. Okay, uh, because I have it nowhere near anything, I'm 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 safe that way. Oh, well, that, that I guess is a dud because I had nothing there for it to convert. I think I may put it right there in that corner just in case there's something like that in the future. We'll find out. Yeah, I'm going to mine everything there. Next. I'm, I'm making enough room that it's taking a little bit of time to get can I double tap no no I don't want to run here like this double tap nope it double tap uh going forward doesn't make me fly any faster which is okay all right I'm going to place a block here in case it's actually going to do some destruction because I'm not all that concerned about that being destroyed uh, no villagers there's nothing really I think I'm I'm missing or, or, you know, doing without that I absolutely should have. Do. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Ah. Oh. Oh, interesting. We got a bunch of beacons, a bunch of uh, materials, a bunch of random color stuff there. Interesting. Okay, I can mine all that up. This. Cool. All right. Uh, all sorts of uh, random bits. Uh, I definitely wouldn't want to hit the the areas with the cobwebs and then get stuck and slowly sink my way down. Then oh, I fall. I fall. So yeah, that's that's cool. Lots of uh, wools and uh, various blocks. Nice. Let's make it over there next time. And you know, five free beacons and a bunch of uh, you know nice blocks. Cool. Okay. I'll 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 take that. Take that uh, in, a, in a twice. So, so far, other than I think the exploding TNT, <laughs> and, and I have no idea what the potions were, other than that, it's not been bad. Uh, yeah, definitely would be majorly problematic in a base. <laughs> having stuff like that appear and overriding any, you know, machines or multi-block machines, that would be even worse. Uh, yeah, that, that would be really bad. But otherwise, yeah, it's not been bad. All right. Let's do it. Let's do it again. You know, I guess I could pull out my infinity wand. I could remake that very easy. All right. Back it up. Inception. Inception what? <laughs> a block inside of a block? Minecraft inside of Minecraft? 
No idea. Okay, um, I'm going to guess that uh, either didn't work because I didn't have the, the blocks it needed right there, or, and this is probably more likely, um, it just had a title and that's all it said. That's all it did. All right, let's grab, uh, we are down to the last four. I'm going to redo that in that corner because why not? That looks like slime, possibly. Yeah, a lot of the bottom ones got overwritten, which is which is sad. Ooh, maybe obsidian. I'll have to play with those and see what they are. Oh, uh, turkey. Somebody uh, wrote something there. All right. Oh, those blocks are all gone. Ew! It. It did eat that up. I wonder how big of an area it would have eaten up. And we'll never know. Because I'm doing it way far away from anything else. Alright, here we go. Alright. Breaking and backing up. Oh. That's a lot of bookcases. And it's still making bookcases. <laughs> I I will have to mine this to see whether or not there's anything inside this. Looks like it's uh, building down and around. So yeah, this would definitely be bad for a base because it's probably uh, replacing whatever blocks are there. Uh, if if it makes a wiggly pattern, then it's obviously a bookworm. All right, I'm going to let that. It's just continually doing its thing. That that would be really bad in a base. But, you know, lots of bookcases. And if you break them without silk touch, three books. Okay, then that would not be bad. Three books is always nice. All right, two left, or three left. Two in the in the chest and one set with me. That's got to have finished by now. And my, my guess is it's probably completely bookcases all the way through, but maybe there's something hiding in there. That's a lot of bookcases. Okay. I think we're probably far enough away to not mess up anything else. Not that I'm going to care that much, but you know, maybe there's something worth it. Here we go. Back it up. Whoop. Oh, this looks like it's going to be a large building. Oh. Hmm. Looks like they, they needed to go one layer lower. And then, then we would get this little bit. Anyway. Ah, this it looks like this is a one of those uh, haunted, uh, not haunted, but uh, woodland mansions. Ooh, ooh. Uh, will it actually have any mobs in here? I don't know, but uh, we've got a chest there. And I'm not seeing any other chests. This would be very nice if it actually has mobs in it. That would be very, very nice. Or if if this counts as a woodland mansion and actually allows them to spawn because then I could actually get uh, the, the DNA swabs, swab the various uh, pillagers and vindicators and evokers and, and whatnot. And yeah, I would be able to get some uh, really cool um, belts off of those for charms. Oh, there's a kitty cat there. Oh, there's another chest. Cool. Okay. That, yeah. I, oh, another chest. Yeah, yeah, uh, this, this is a, definitely a good one if it will give me mobs. Uh, if, it, if it doesn't give me mobs, oh, the, oh there's a vanilla mob spawning in there. And those are not all that interesting. But the rest are. I, it, once you light this up, there's your base. <laughs> there's your base built for you. Uh, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. All right, I'm going to let that finish doing its thing. While I uh, grab another one. Yeah, we've got mob spawning here because it's night. Oh, I think he saw me. Yeah, he saw me from a distance. <laughs> Those guys are jerks. 
if they see me from that far away. Yeah, I think he's coming over to, to get to me. All right, let's grab, you know, I'm going to uh, risk certain death and uh, take the other one with me. Hi there, you. Would you like to uh, get killed? Yes, you did. Oh, okay, good. Ooh, they do a lot of lightning and I've got shocked on me. <laughs> so yeah, lots of mobs in here because uh, there's no lights down there. Now there's a light. Now there's a light. <laughs> Uh, I love being able to toss lights from a distance like that. That's very cool. Uh, I, and I should light this up so we don't have gobs and gobs and gobs of mobs here on the server. Uh, looks like there's a witch in here. Sadly, does not look like it's going to give me the actual mob spawning unless they're in here some way. All right, I'll, I'll, I'll have to test with that. But that's cool. That's I should grab like a schematic of that. That that would be loads of fun. All right, a little bit further away. Let's uh, load this one up. Let's grab that back. And... Yeah, okay, there's all 27. All right, break and back up. <laughs> the floor is lava. Well, I'm waiting for the floor to turn into lava. I bet you if I had a block there, it would have turned into lava. Uh, that would have been very interesting. Let's say howdy to goose. All right, howdy goose. Nah, I didn't want to do that. I hit the uh, Windows key and it toggled me out. And it goes goose. All right, last one. Uh, it doesn't look like it did anything here. So uh, let's back up just a little bit more. Put that there. Alrighty, here we go. Last, and, and I have no more chance cubes at this point. Can I make chance? I can. Do I want to make chance cubes? No, I do not. <laughs> uh, this is a lot of quests, and uh, I, I was no way was I going to open each one of those individually. But this way I will. Yeah, this looks very much like the other one we just had over there. Okay, so we got a duplicate. Spiral, spiral, spiral. And and this would work as a killing area for the 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 Gaia Guardian if you got rid of the uh, the the cobwebs and that needed to go down a little bit and then some other stuff in there. But and I I wouldn't use that here for for that. But Cool. All right. So uh, there's some very interesting bits from here. Uh, I, I definitely need to uh, light these things up so that we don't have lots and lots and lots of these mobs spawning here because that's causes tick and who wants that or I should just sleep. But uh, anyway, yeah, uh, I, I'm curious to explore this. I'm curious to see if there's anything cool in the, uh, the, the village area and really, really curious about the 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 mining these ores if i get anything from uh venus that is very very worth it we will find out all right well there you go <laughs> that that was not nearly as doomific doomerific as i thought it would be but uh having flight and doing it far away from your base definitely good ideas definitely good ideas pew <laughs> anyway it's been fun uh, even if it hasn't been a, a completely destructive. And speaking of destructive, I should go through and clean all of this up and, and see what I got from all these cubes. But I think I'll give that to Future Grok because I'm going to go take a nap. Future Grok here. And let me just say that past Grok is a jerk because he could have done all this work himself and he chose not to. But that's okay. I've got the, the digital miner right here, and it's been doing a good job of, of cleaning up. Uh, I, I manually used my fortune pick on the, the big tall columns of the ores. And then I used buckets uh, with the, the glass globs that had the different uh, fluids in them. And yeah, I did 
do some vein mining of of the the dirt and stuff for the village but i used the the miner here uh it was so much easier to just use that to just pick up everything i'd start it running go off to my base do some work and um, right now it's proceeding through the uh woodland structure it had something like thirty-two thousand blocks that it had to mine and let's take a look, quick look it says i'm down to six thousand at this point so okay that's doing a much better job and if we fall down here you can see how it, it's doing its weird way of chewing up that's where it's working right now a uh, weird way of chewing things up uh, it's leaving these the, the the loot chests which is fine it also leaves wool and these potted plants so i've been going around afterwards and breaking them up uh, anybody that uh, comes to my base and then travels south uh, can help themselves to these uh, loot chests because they're here. Uh, there's a couple, at least one in the village that's up there just a little bit, but uh, these ones may be a little bit more interesting. They have uh, Vex uh, smithing template thingies in them that I picked up. So uh, yeah, it's been slowly picking this up and uh, taking it back to the base. And speaking of which, uh, let's go back home. And I'll show you what, uh, what's been happening over here. Oh, I, I was going to zip over, but oh, I'll just fly. Uh, what I did to help uh, speed things up, let me right click and that'll go away. Uh, I set up these little drawers, added a, a couple uh, implements into them to boost up the, uh, the, the storage area. And so this is mostly, mostly the the mansion uh, it's it's picked up a little bit of the stuff from the now i'm drawing a blank oh the the village that was in in front um but you know it's it's collecting so i've got 38 of uh, these uh flower pots from there uh these few flowers i'll just stick away in here and it's done a real good job of um processing storing all the stuff I, i've kept this spruce and all this is dark coat just because this is temperate I, I don't feel like keeping all of these things. I'll 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 take stuff like these different slabs and I'll not slabs, these are planks. I'll take them and I'll put them elsewhere. So they have their own dedicated uh, spot for them. Uh, but you know uh, the other thing I do is I come running over here, run, 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 run. And in this spot there, uh yeah. Oh, birch fences. Okay. I don't have a spot for birch fences and I think there's not enough of them to care. Uh, I am going to go ahead and get rid of these things. Uh, the cobblestone and the slabs, I don't care. Oh, although I've got two, I could just go like this. Ink. Uh, <laughs> what I did do is I set up a little uh, trash can back here. This is a trapped chest. You can tell by the little bit of red around here. There is a item um, pipe down here with a basic upgrade where I told it to be off when powered. So when I open this and I dump in stuff, yeah, I don't care about the birch fences either. Nothing's happening because it's powered because the chest is open. But as soon as I close it up there, you can see 21, 13, 5. It just slowly eats that away by shoving it into a trash can. I've been doing a few things where I've been uh, tossing stuff. I'll fly over and just use the void as a trash can. <laughs> I'll fill up inventory, come over here, and then just pitch a bunch of stuff. But I've lost my my uh, silky pick here twice doing that, um, mining things and hitting the, the Q key accidentally. And then I was going, well, crap. <laughs> so I had to make a new one twice, <laughs> enchant it twice and uh but that's okay i've got uh, all the materials for that to do it it just was mm. uh some of the 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 cobble i've just ground up here and uh nope and left uh pushed it down below to, to process and uh, small stuff i just don't care speaking of stuff that i looted uh i set up these chests this here is what i used with my fortune pick on all those those columns of ores unfortunately nothing really cool the only thing really new is the yellowite ore but i can just convert uranium to yellowite back and forth so that's not a big deal uh uranium tin you know it's just, it's, it's just all the same stuff new stuff ruby sapphire is there another one no it looks like it's just ruby and sapphire is all i got out of out of that yeah okay that i was really 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 hoping to have some some mars and the moon and and venus specific ores no uh this is those those two big massive circles 
that had the the beacons on them uh, i took the ores you know the the iron the emerald the diamond and whatnot i took those out and the the dirt and cobble i uh, got rid of those but this is everything from all of those so lots and lots of nifty sort of stuff I, I i do like the cobwebs i do like putting those around i've got tons of obsidian that's a lot of wool <laughs> and lots of melons uh so that there's that this here was the 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 stuff I got from the village that I decomposed and I, again cobble and dirt and stuff like that I got rid of. Oh oh, uh, this here, uh, all these bookshelves. Some of those came from that big massive worm of of bookshelves. Most of those I just broke and let fall into the void. <laughs> you, you get to this point, you go. I just don't care about the rest of the bookshelves. So probably like five times as many of these uh, got got lost. Anyway, so there's the village, and here are the the fluids I got from the the the, the two balls of glass that I filled up. Not um, anything that I'm really jumping around. Although, yeah, etching acid, uh, pneumatic craft is something I need to get into and etching acid may be something of, of use there. This right here is 256 buckets worth of vegetable oil, all of that from the one container. And uh, I, I, I started off with saying, OK, let me do buckets. And I said, that's a lot of buckets because it's a huge thing. So I said, OK, let me make a, a fluid tank. I, I made it all the way up to elite because I had all the bits and I started sucking it all down with this in bucket mode. And then I realized, oh, I need a lot more space. So I made the extra bits to make the ultimate and it exactly filled up <laughs> from that. So um, it, it, nothing, nothing super, super interesting out of here. Uh, a few things that are kind of interesting. Oh, there's another vegetable oil. There were a couple of them. Yeah, from from their solium steam raw. Yeah. Nothing here that uh, that I barely, no, nothing here that I really look and go, oh, yeah, that's I could really, really use this. Rocket fuel. No, no, I was thinking rocket fuel for Ad Astra, but nope, 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 nope. So yeah, I, I don't know if I'll do anything with those, but that's just kind of the way it is. But uh, still, that was that was pretty fun. Um, okay, I'm I'm gonna do one other thing uh, with you right now. Let's go zip over here. I I had used up my my gold coins, and then I said, well, I've got huge amounts of copper coins, three to one you can combine those into silver coins. Here's 60 of those. Let me grab those. Um, then three to one, you can combine your silver coins into gold coins. And now I've got enough for two. Uh, and why do I always turn to the left? I do not know. Uh, if I come down to here, to the coin shop, I can turn in some of these. So let's turn in that. And what did I get? Awaken boots. Don't hair. <laughs> Flight augment. <laughs> I've got both of those things, so it's not a big deal. Uh, so I will toss. What? How did I get an additional eight? Huh. Okay. Um, I wonder if one of those had uh, gave me coins as well. I'll have to recheck the video, but. Yeah, okay, so I've got backup boots and I've got uh, another flight augment. If I need to recreate my armor, well, I only need to recreate a, a little bit. <laughs> I, and now I'm, I'm out of uh, my... Oh, wait a second. I do have another 20. Okay, well, we'll do one more. I keep wanting to turn to the left. <laughs> what did that give me? Insanium farmland. <laughs> Uh, I, I've already got lots of insanium. All right, uh, I'm out of um, chance cubes. I'm out of uh, my coins. And um, that was kind of fun. Uh, not not uber productive, but it was still kind of fun. <laughs> anyway, this has been uh, Future Gark here playing on the FTOG Ozone Skyblock Reborn server and having a, a blast, even though past Gark, he's kind of a jerk. And thanks for watching. Bye.